The Amazon S3 how-to video series is an in-depth video guide on everything from what is Amazon AWS and S3 to streaming S3 videos and many features in between. Have a look below this video to see a list of the titles and times of each video in this series. Now in order for you to make a more informed buying decision, I've created this sample video for you. This sample video contains a snippet of a few videos in this series so you can see and hear the quality that you're about to download. So without further ado, Amazon S3 how-to videos. Amazon S3 is one of the products offered by Amazon's web services, also known as AWS. AWS is like a toolbox and S3 is like one of the many tools in that toolbox that Amazon.com offers. Now S3 is short for Simple Storage Service and is kind of like your computer's hard drive, only with unlimited storage space. In this video, you're going to look over my shoulder as I show you how to get the links we need to display images that are hosted on our Amazon S3 account as well as other file types like PDFs or even zip files. And we will use what is called query string to secure these links. This type of security allows for you to display these files like images for example or even PDFs or downloadable zip files for a specified time that you lay out and these links can be revived by simply refreshing the page or reloading the page that they're on. Now a great example of this, in the next two videos I'm going to show you how to stream videos from your website. This video will be showing you from a static HTML website and the next video will be from a WordPress site. Now the first thing to do is to get the proper video formats so that your video will stream or play on all major browsers. The formats you're going to need are MP4 and WebM. If you do not have these two formats, but you have a different format, like say for example MOV or WMV or AVI, then you can use a file converter to get the MP4 and WebM. Now you can do a search for video file converter, and let me just show this puts to rest any questions you might have regarding the audio or video quality. I hope this small sample was to your liking. If you still have any questions, please let me know. Thank you very much for your interest in my videos, and I'll see you on the other side.